What's up, y'all? YouTube World, we back in it. Listen, we got another episode for y'all today. I got my boy, Mr. Smith, Mr. Smith A1 in the building. Make sure y'all like, subscribe, yes, sir. hit that thumbs up if you're new to this channel. Tad Night Boy, y'all seen him before. Let's get right into it. All right? Listen. My boy Marcus came through last time, did his thing. He got a question. He got to ask me personally. Let's get into it. Uh, The personal question for me was just as far as... Um, Mike on. What has Kobe Bryant really did without better support than LeBron has? Um, the question I also asked was, who was the best coach that LeBron James has ever had? I asked, who are the top five coaches in NBA history? And the best coach that LeBron James has ever had, I was just curious to see if he was on that top five. LeBron James never had none of the, the coaches I got. LeBron had never had one of the top five coaches that I, on my top five list. In my top five list, they got their only person top five. My top five. LeBron I don't think anybody's top five. LeBron never coached. Le, he was never called by a top five coach. I don't think. In, in, I, my, in my opinion, I don't think anybody would say otherwise. Right. I think everybody that knows anything about LeBron. basketball would agree with you. LeBron had never had one. He's never, never had, had it. Never had a great coach. I mean, I'm never had. had never the had best coach. coach, I asked my guy David, who was the best coach LeBron James has ever had. Who'd you say? I say Eric Spoelstra. And the crazy thing about that is I said Eric Spoelstra got LeBron James in his rookie year of being a head coach. No, it was a it, it, sophomore year. No, sophomore. that was his first year. Google. Just Google. Nigga, Google. I'm telling you. I'm telling he was you. a ball boy. How about, see, this is what I love about Just this. Just Google. That's what I love. We can Google it. Nigga. We can. But keep talking, my boy. We can. Is, I'm going to keep say? talking. I'm going to keep talking. Eric Spolster's first year of being a head coach was the first that year LeBron Eric James was the first year LeBron James came to the Miami Heat. Eric Spolster. We'll take the time to do diligence about it. Hey, I wish we had a commercial for you guys. So that way we don't be wasting your time to sit here. But at the end of the day, I'll give you some basketball knowledge. LeBron James has never had a top five coach in NBA history. Kobe, if you think about it, Kobe Bryant had Phil Jackson. LeBron James never had Phil Jackson. Michael Jordan had Phil Jackson. LeBron James never had that once again. D. Wade had Pat Riley. LeBron James had Pat Riley as a GM, not a coach. There's a difference. Mike Brown was the coach of LeBron James when he made when he took a team of paper players to an Eastern Conference championship. They won sixty three games. He still can't get a job right now. He still can't get a job right now. Well, you know what? Mike Brown is coaching for the Sacramento Kings right now, and he's actually he's he's making them look a lot better than they were. All right, so hey, so we back to the facts. Like I said, he was the NBA. He was, a, he was an NBA head coach, 2008 in prison. LeBron J, LeBron J got there in 2010. Also, Eric Spoelstra is a top 15 NBA Eric coach. Eric Spoelstra, no, pull it, put it out so the camera so people can see. Let's, let, 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 we, don't, we don't lie to the people, American people at home. Eric Spoelstra was, was a head coach? About, this was just channel about 2008, if you can see. Okay. You may not see. 2008, my boy Marcus, you can see. Miami head coach, 2008 prison. He was the assistant coach, 1998. Then he stepped into the 2008. So hold on, hold on. Where, where, where is this? Where does it say that it's for two for 2008? He was the head coach. Right. Where does it say that? He had coach coaching history. So nineteen eighty, he was assistant. 1997, 2008. I don't see a name coach. on there. Then he started 2008 present. Eric Spoelstra position head coach. He started career history. Would you say he was the head coach when? 2008. 2008 in prison. Miami Heat. What year did LeBron go to Miami? 2010. 2010. Sorry, my mic. Hey, how my about mic this? Got Let's ask this then. If that's the case, I have to go look up with it. Look, look in more detail with that. Just about what it. did he win? Oh, he was the playoffs. What did he win? Went to the playoffs. What did he win? Went to the playoffs. What did he win? He didn't win the championship. He didn't win it. Has he won a championship without LeBron? Because he did make it to the finals again, didn't he? Actually, when he first got LeBron, he, he didn't did win. He did make it to the finals again after LeBron, did he? Yes, he did. Has he won a no. championship? Actually, he lost to LeBron. Crazy thing. I'm... Hold on. 
He lost to LeBron. He lost to LeBron and Anthony Davis in the bubble. Disney Mouse. Disney. How many? What was the first championship he won then? Since he was there. In Disney. What was the first championship he won? Disney. What was the first championship he won, my guy? I'm asking you a question. He won one in 2012. He should have won one in 2011. LeBron on. What was the first year he won? He never won without LeBron. Okay, cool. Thank you. That's all I need. Is, is it fair to say LeBron cost him 2011 finals? You can say whatever you want to I'm, say. I'm not asking you. That's cool. Yeah. No, no. Okay. Let's, say, let's okay. say it's fair. Okay. How about this? Okay. Has LeBron won without Eric Spolster? Yes. Matter of fact, LeBron has, has Eric Spolster won without LeBron. No. Matter of fact, LeBron ain't won with two other coaches too. Ty Lue. What does that mean? He, he, won yeah, he, went, he, he went three to a coaches. different team. Is Eric Spolster no, supposed no. to coach that team too? No. I'm just telling you, that's a great achievement. He Thank you. He on the I'm like, what is that? Because I, I know you were saying you presenting stuff out there. I didn't know where you was going. Because I was like, no, that didn't make no, sense. Had nothing to do with LeBron winning. Exactly. <laughs> Me neither. I, like, it's LeBron. But how about this? Who's the greatest coach in NBA history? In your opinion, I asked you earlier. My, you talking to me? Top right? three. Top three. Give me top three. Pop, Pat Riley. Pat Riley. Red Auerbach. And Greg Popovich. Uh, if you breaking them down. First. He said Greg Popovich over Pat Riley. No, no. He said he, he's trying to be biased. Is that oh, you mean Phil Jackson? You, you, you said exactly. You, you, you're wrong. You know, Yo, over, Phil, over Phil Jackson. No, no, no. I'm putting it order. Over Phil Jackson. Pat Riley over Phil Jackson. Greg, uh, any coach over Phil Jackson? Yes. Any coach. Can I, can I explain? Any coach. What can I explain? It could be football. Yeah, can I explain? It could be football. Can we explain? Any coach. What, what? How many rings does how, how many rings does Phil Jackson have as a coach? He has eleven. Who has more rings as a coach? Phil Jackson. Who has more rings than him as a coach? Phil, nobody got more rings than Phil Jackson. Nobody. And there's another coach that's better than him. Yes. What you telling me? I think a lot of people in the sports world would agree to that. Crazy. Who's your favorite player? My favorite player is Kobe Bryant. Who did he win with? Phil Jackson. The year he didn't have Phil Jackson as a coach, what he do? Average 27 points, missed the playoffs. What did he win? What did he win? Miss the playoffs. Missed the Thank playoffs. You. Thank you. That's all I needed. 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 So what, how, how many times, short of LeBron being 19, year 19. 20. Near, no, you're missing the point. What I'm saying, you didn't let me finish speaking. Short of LeBron being in year 19, year 20. What great coach has LeBron been with when he missed the playoffs? You said what coach? Yeah. Well, how many years has LeBron missed the playoffs? Short of these Laker years. I was about to say Laker. His first two years. Short of the first two years of his, his, his rookie years. Yes, first two years. Was, no, 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 after year. after shot left, did Kobe Bryant miss the playoffs? One time. One time. And then next year, who he get? Nobody. Paul Gasol. No, he did. It's a lie. Just you cannot you cannot lie. That's what we don't do on this show. We don't lie. The next year, he did not get Paul Gasol. Oh, yeah, right oh, yeah. He had Kwame Brown and Smush Park. He made the playoffs? Yes. Have you, ever heard, five next season? have you ever heard of the Ray Allen curse? What's the Ray Allen curse? Oh, man. He, he know about the Ray Allen curse. Let me say to you. You don't know. Ray Allen, Ray Allen called Kobe Bryant out for being not as good as... Mind you, Kobe is fully fine. He's fully stand up. Kobe Bryant is Philly's finest. Kobe Bryant can't make it without another superstar. I'm talking about going nowhere. Not, not making the playoffs. Not make They get eliminated before even making the playoffs. If Kobe Bryant doesn't have a Lamar Odom, a Pau Gasol, a, a Andrew Bynum, a, all these other players who were still in their prime, because I know how... People like to say LeBron had this player. He had this player on the back end of their career. Mind you, that's neither here nor there. Kobe Bryant has had the best of the best in their prime. I'm not gonna lie, man. LeBron has a list before the game. Uh, no, you, you, you <laughs> ain't no. I'm gonna lie. You, that, that's what it is. What it is. LeBron James won 63 games with Anthony Everybody Parker. Anthony Parker. Been- Daniel Marshall. Miami, yeah, you can say that. I'm saying Miami. And even still, how about this? I like to point that part out there too. After LeBron went to Miami, how about this start? Let's start this. LeBron went to Miami when Miami hadn't even made the playoffs. 
He got there. They went four straight finals. He left there. They still had the same nucleus, same great ass coach. Like little bro just said, little bro just said Eric Spoelstra. Eric Spoelstra was still there. They still had Chris Bosh. They still had D Wade. All of these players they said saved LeBron James' career. Why couldn't they make the playoffs when LeBron left? Because LeBron James ended up going to the worst team in in, in the NBA. And to Cleveland, you goddamn right. He ends up going to Cleveland and takes them from being the worst team. They had the lottery pick three out of four years that LeBron was in Miami going to the finals. Cleveland was getting three lottery picks. Three lottery picks out of four years. Even though those four years, LeBron was going to the finals. He leaves Miami. Miami falls to not making the playoffs. He goes to the worst team in the league, and all of a sudden they go to making four straight finals? Y'all converse about that. I got to I gotta take me a break for a second. Y'all can talk about that. Hey, LeBron going to explain that part to you. Yeah. He's going to explain that part to you. This is my man. This is LeBron. He got you, though. He's going to explain to you how LeBron can go from the worst team in the NBA, bring them to the best team, go to a team who didn't make the playoffs, take them to four straight finals, leave them, go back to the worst team, take them to straight four finals, and the team he just left from taking the four straight finals, they're not even making the playoffs. LeBron going to explain how that happens and the common denominator and how that works. YouTube world. Uh, that's a long, that was long. Uh, it was. No, I appreciate you. That was long. Uh, I'm glad he got that off. Whew, that was so many lies told. <laughs> lies. I'm talking. I got the flow. <laughs> you are. <laughs> that was like 10 minutes. He got the floor, fam. I'm not even sure I want to even waste too much time on it. He came. This is, it was like, that's a 9, that's a 10, that's a 11, that's a 12. It's not even worth getting my blood pressure over. This guy sitting here talking about, this guy talking about Kobe had more help than LeBron James. Let me tell you something. Let me, let me spin out what I'm saying. I'm talking. The more Odom never made an all-star team in his career. You know that. No, 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 no. Did you know that? Before you, Lamar, Lamar never made an all-star team. Andrew Bobby made one all-star team in his career. One all-star team in his career. The fact that you brought up Andrew Bobby and Lamar Odom to practice Chris Fox and Kevin Love, who do you think about Chris Fox and Kevin Love? Hey, crazy thing about that. Can I chime in? No, no, no. no. I'm talking. I'm talking. Can I chime in? No, no, no. See, he asked a question, but he doesn't want anybody to chime in. He can in. answer. I'm asking him. He can answer. I can't answer. I'm asking him. I got it. Chris he don't have the knowledge. He don't have the knowledge. That's why he don't want to ask me. He don't want to ask me because he know I got the knowledge. No, you do not. Then ask me then. Do I get the next question? Ask me the same question. Chris Bosh and Kevin Love. Ask me the same question then. Who's better? Chris Bosh, Kevin Love, or anybody with Lamar? In their primes? In their primes. So how about this? Chris Bosh. Outside of Kevin Love, we're, we're compared to two the power forwards that LeBron played with. Kevin Love was more efficient for the Timberwolves than Chris Bosh was. Right? Give you that. Chris Bosh took a back seat and a lesser, a higher role. Kevin Love took a lower role than Chris Bosh took when he played with LeBron. And still accomplish more. Chris Bosh wasn't averaging the same numbers as Kevin Love was. I, I say this. And their own team. And might seem as though I'm defeating my own argument. Watch where I'm going with this. Kevin Love went from a playing in the paint. Offensive player. To just shooting threes. And still average more than Chris Bosh did. Even when he was with the Heat, if you look at the numbers, Chris Bosh, who was in the paint, was more. 
Kevin Love, when his own team didn't average the same amount of points. I mean, he averaged more than Chris Bosh did when Chris Bosh had his own team. Kevin Love played by himself but never did anything. Chris Bosh at least made the playoffs. We look at talent, we look at skill, but we don't look at how certain players play the position and how they adapt. Kevin Love took a lesser role than Chris Bosh was forced to take a role of. Chris Bosh was still getting the ball like a number two player. You can't tell me he wasn't. They were still looking. They were still looking for Chris Bosh to score, dog. Kevin Love and Chris Bosh have the same amount of points playing the Brooklyn. Kevin, that's my point. Kevin Love was reduced to being a three-point shooter. Chris Bosh did too. Chris Bosh was still playing in the paint. What are you talking about? Mid-range. 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 So mid-range. What's easier to shoot, mid-range or three-point? Mid-range is the hardest shot in basketball. It's the worst shot to take. I gotta go. Nobody I gotta go. <laughs> why was? How about this? Why? Why did Jordan, his player, his player? Why was Jordan's percentage? Because mind you, Jordan's better than LeBron, right? Absolutely. 1, Why is Jordan's three point shot a shorter percentage or lower percentage than LeBron James then? Because they didn't shoot the three. It's a harder shot, bro. No, it's not. It is. It's not. It is. It's not. It is. It's not. What? This is what? Hold on, hold on. What, 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 what do players have a higher percentage at? Shooting free, free throws or three pointers? Steph Curry, what's his percentage better at? Shooting free throws or three pointers? It's funny you say that because Jordan is. I asked you. I asked you a question about Steph Curry. I said something about Steph Curry. I you said, right "Who's now. the great?" No, 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 hold on. I'm making a point. Who's, who's, who's the greatest shooter of all time, though? Let's make this. Where are Steph Curry? Steph Curry to me. Steph Curry, go ahead. Steph Curry, Steph Curry. I was like Ray Allen. No, yeah, Steph Curry. Ray, 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 Ray Allen can shoot, but Steph Curry. Ray Allen's up there, but Steph Curry is the best. Thank you. I asked who but is the best. Who? He might he got a opinion. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He might somebody. Make we're not asking opinions. Who's the who's the all time leading scorer? You want to ask opinions? No, who's the, who's the all, no? We're not asking opinions. We're asking facts. Who's the all time leading scorer? LeBron James. There's no opinion about that. That is an opinion about that. That's a longevity award. Who who who's the best running back all time? No, it's not. Emmitt Smith. No, fuck no. Emmitt Smith not the best running back all time. He got the most pressure, y'all. Stop it. That's not, that's not, that's why I talk about this guy. He's you talking not. about score? I watch it. Nobody. Who has the most rings in NBA history? Bill that's, Russell. That's a fact, nigga. You have an opinion. What the fuck are you talking about? That's a fact. About that. Nigga, it's a, the same reason I just told you the same thing about LeBron or Steph Curry. Nigga, it's a fact. It's not an opinion. What the fuck are you talking about? Oh, sorry, I don't like about this, nigga. Nigga, it's a fact. Steph Curry is statistically. Steph Curry is statistically the best shooter. And, and I don't fuck with Steph Curry. He's not my favorite player. Nigga, I asked you a question to prove a point. What about Chris Bosh and Kevin Love, bro? Nigga, I'm going off to, to tell you what's a fact. Well, something is a fact. It's not a matter of opinion. What do Chris Bosh and Kevin Love, bro? It's switched, okay? We switched, though. We switched to Dog. Kevin Ray Allen. No, I'm not switching to that. No, it's not a matter of matter switching that, but let's use that as an example. No, what I'm saying is Kevin, Kevin Love. When you going back to this, because I just listened to you say this. You said it's a matter of opinion. I'm going to ask you one more time. Because this is just straight. A fact. Fact. Straight up and down. No, 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 nobody going to understand. Gonna agree with you, straight. Fact. Gonna up and down. Play. Who is the leading scorer of NBA? Yeah, LeBron, everybody, you know, just there's a straight. There's no, there's no opinion about that. Numbers don't lie about shit. So you think he's the best ever? I don't think anything. The numbers say that. I don't think anything. Statistics say that. Statistics say that. Yeah. Statistics say that. The I don't care. About- we got it. the best running back of all time. You heard here. Like, subscribe. I'm now, out. see, that's a whole different thing. <laughs> no, it's not. Now, see, that no, is. Not. Because 